So, yeah, we are just doing the difficult thing now. We are removing. Sir, for one minute. That's because of the beard that has grown in. Just wait a little bit. The lotion is all. Still, there will be a little bit thing. You can't solve this. Okay, 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 one minute. Okay, we start this side again. Yeah. You want to try yourself? Just try. Just try. And now try. Is it better if you do yourself? I'll try. Yeah, yeah, you can do it. If, if, if some patients feel it better, if they do it themselves. Do it gently, no problem. Take your time. Cut one of photo cut meanwhile. Here some Some more lotion I'll put there. Side larka. Other side. Straight it. Ha, that is okay. So while the patient is helping us and helping himself, I'm going to show you what basically his concerns were. So if you look at this face clearly, this angle was more deeper than this one. This was more protrusive. So he had what is called as a lower third facial asymmetry. Now if you do this, you can see that the right side was not exactly the left side. And this was because of the shape of the bone of the lower third of the face, which is the mandible. So what we did was we worked on this part of the bone alone. That's why you can see he's got plasters on the right side. Uh, we didn't do anything on the left part because the left side was a nice side as far as he was concerned. So we worked on this side of the bone. We also did his chin. So you can see we've got a nice stronger chin for him, which is desirous of. And this has gone in already. Even if you look straight away the symmetry, why don't you look? Yeah. It's already symmetry. And this is going to get better because remember we worked on the bone. Bone takes four weeks to heal. I keep saying this. And then there's muscles on top of that. That also takes a few weeks to heal. So this is going to take some more time before this heals up. And then he has a nice proportional face. If you look at this face, you can also see in the mirror. This face is more towards the square shape. And now if you look at his face, it's more angular. So just by increasing the height of the chin, by making it more proportional, by getting that symmetry sorted out, we have made his face more proportional and thereby more aesthetically pleasing. That's what we've done. So this is again a cosmetic surgery. In the same procedure, asymmetry was fixed and also the improvement in the facial ratios or facial proportion. So what do you think? It's good. I think it's very good. Yeah. And uh, you got to take care for four more weeks so that everything heals. Preferably don't sleep on the right side for five more days. Avoid any injury to the chin. Take the medications. Take good care. No alcohol and stuff like that for at least a few more days. That's it. You will be good. And you can send us a picture. Skipping and everything exercise after a month, minimum one month, you just give it a break uh, because major exercise can make some bleeding or some trauma or something like that. Good. How was your pain experience on a scale from 0 to 10? No, this thing I would give a 9. Now? Yeah. Okay, now is 9. After surgery, I would give it a 6. 6 after surgery and 9. You guys heard that? So, <laughs> surgery <laughs> See, was... <laughs> it is like doing surgery without anesthesia. I mean, uh, my correct, mind. I know. Many patients have told us this, especially men. I do agree with you. In fact, people have given me a score of 8 and 2 and you're saying 9 and 6. Uh, that's fair enough. And unfortunately, even though we're looking at a solution without this pain, we haven't arrived at a good one because this plaster really, you see, 
how nicely it takes the swelling in and so that's something we need Last a long time. I know. It's okay, five minutes pain. Five minutes pain is alright, like a quick waxing. Absolutely. And you did it yourself, so I think you felt that pain less and did one of our works. Right. So are you leaving today? Yes, leaving at seven. Seven, okay. And you go back to Bangalore. Bangalore. Okay, so he's not far away from where we are. We do have lots of patients from India, Silicon Valley. Alright, safe journey. And uh, stay in touch, we'll give you the follow-up number so you can message us and if anything is there, uh, do let us know. Bye-bye.